previously on Survivor. Jenny felt on the outside of her former Toei alliance. Tribal Council was kind of unexpected. I didn't really realize that Holly was going to leave. And she made plans to team up with Maggie and JJ. I think I want my alliance to be with Maggie and JJ because I think I can get Maggie to turn on JJ and we could vote him off when it comes to the final three. The alliance of Rachel, Taylor, Connor, and Fred disagreed about who should be the next to go. JJ, he's a very good talker, but um, the girls want to get rid of John. We told them that um, John is going to be a huge threat in the future, which I don't know if that's true, but they believed it. The immunity challenge came down to Jenny and JJ, but JJ came up short again, granting Jenny her second individual immunity win. Jenny! Jenny's win made Rachel and Taylor rethink the pecking order. Jenny, like, she's won the past two immunities. The second she doesn't win immunity, I think she's going to be gone. Before Tribal Council, Connor confronted Taylor about the hidden immunity idols. Do you have an idol? No. Rachel did find one here, but she is here. At Tribal Council, the entire tribe followed Rachel and Taylor's lead. It's your time to shine as a jury member and John joined Holly on the jury. John, try this book. Time for you to go. Seven are left. Who will be voted out next? Put a knife in and oh, pierce yeah. it right here and then oh, yeah. right there and then put the twine there. Yeah, two holes. Yeah. Do you want to handle that, Fred? I'm going to suck at tying knots, but I'll help you. You can do an appearance as well. I'll do everything but tying. All right. I feel really bad for voting John out. Like, we all agreed because he, he he's really nice, and but nice doesn't really cut it when you're out in the wilderness surviving. All right, we just got back from tribal council and voted out John. He was blindsided. Big time. I don't think he saw that coming at all. And, you know, in this game, you have to make those big moves. It's kind of a bummer. I don't think anyone really wanted to vote him out, but it was really vital for me and Rachel that we convinced Connor and Fred not to vote out JJ because we're thinking he's important for us later on. So we kind of just had to get rid of John, and we all feel really, really bad because he's so nice, but it had to be done. We all lied to him, and so I feel like... and. <laughs> The rest of the tribe feels really bad about it, but I didn't get to know him, so I feel like I'm like the heartless one, because I just kind of got over it. I mean, it's like part of the game. To stay in the game, you gotta just go with majority, unless you want to be next. So hopefully it benefited me. Um, so yeah, it, it was really sad to see him go. I really, he was a good guy. Obviously, all of my allies are pretty much gone, um, so I've had to form new ones. Um, I think mostly I trust Jenny just because she's really sincere. Um, we've really become friends. Um, we have a plan um, for top two. The person I least trust would probably be Taylor. Um, Taylor kind of is not very friendly at first. I, well, she's nice. She's just not um, open to like 
becoming an ally with me, I guess you could say. Um, Taylor's just, she seems to be kind of like the ringleader of the most powerful group left. So I think Jenny and I can get JJ on our side to vote out Rachel and Taylor. Um, I feel like it's still gonna go as expected, at least one more round. Um, then it, I think it might get tricky. I, I, I'm kind of worried right now just because it's the high schoolers, all of the people that are left are high schoolers, and then there's me. And so, uh, that sucks. Previously, um, I was kind of allies with um, Connor, Fred, Taylor, and Rachel. But that would, I mean, I'd definitely be the first one voted off there because I'm not as close to them. So since the merge recently, I've tried to kind of align myself with Maggie and JJ and see if I mean, obviously we don't have the numbers there, but I don't know. I think Jenny winning two immunities, I mean, it sets her as a physical threat, definitely. She's one of the strongest girls here. Apart from Taylor, I think Taylor could actually be maybe better in challenges later on. She just hasn't gotten that competitiveness. I think she'll get it on the third day. And, I mean, Jenny, Jenny yeah, she's really good physically, and Rachel and Taylor want to take her out as soon as she doesn't win immunity, so see how the next immunity challenge goes. Uh, after Jenny won the second immunity challenge, it was kind of a big like uh, spotlight on her and kind of just made us realize that she is a huge threat and that we're going to probably have to get rid of her sooner than we were planning on before. Me and Rachel, I think we're pretty tight to the final two and we just get along really well and we kind of have the same thinking strategy. So. We know who to go for, and I think we're on the same page for everything. There's not really any good places. There's too many. Did you see that cave right over there? Cave? Yeah, there's a, there's a cave right there. I just found it. What? The people that are in control, I think, that are kind of running the show would be Fred, Rachel, Taylor, and myself, because we're kind of the core. And then if we get rid of one more person, then we're going to ride this thing straight to the end, and then it's anybody's game. But I really think that they both have both the idols. Do you really? Think I that? do. Well, I told him. I know exactly where one idol is. It's not there. And Taylor was the one to get the second. Um, she did find it? I don't know if she found it, but she got the second clue. So that kind of gives it away. So I don't I don't know how obvious they are out there either. It's Fred and Connor, those two are just kind of wild cards, because I know they have a really strong alliance. So far, they seem pretty trustworthy, but I feel like as it goes on, those two are just going to try and get everyone else out so they can be the final two. I've been talking with Taylor and Rachel and their idea is to possibly split them up. And so, you know, I don't know. They feel, I feel like those two are pretty, pretty trustworthy right now, but I don't think you can really, I, per, I don't think I personally can trust anyone 100% anymore. Yeah. I kind of want to stick, yeah, I kind of want to stick with I really want to stick forward. with them, but if they have both, like, I think Holly might have one. Which, if she d did have one, she definitely did not see her getting out coming. How could Holly have one if Rachel played one? What do you mean? Rachel I'm played an idol. Did you, you didn't know that? Oh, she did? That's what she said. She, she said that played. she played. That's how Martha got out. But I don't think that's true because, I mean, if you think about it, like, JJ didn't like Martha. They've been really, they're really strategic players. They say they have an idol. Rachel said she played it. But I've decided I don't believe a word that they say. I think they're telling them telling lies. I mean, I just don't believe them. I could see him totally get, wanting to get me and Fred to think that. So we're going to try and get one of them out next. Not, uh, I think what I'm going to suggest to Fred is not the next vote, but when we're at top six, because then I think we can get him out there. For some I think they, I don't want, I want, I don't want to risk it. So you want to get him out? I want to get one of them out. How do you plan on doing this? What we could do is to make it not look like it's our fault. Just scheme with the other people. Try to get one of them out. Try to convince them to get one of them out. And then vote for someone else. And then we can say we have no part in it. And we can keep the alliance with the opponent that stays. Fred still wants to get out uh, Rachel or Taylor for whatever reason. I'd rather keep them around a little bit longer for some reason. And get out like someone like Jenny because Jenny's more of a threat and challenges. You want to take out Rachel? Or you want to take out Taylor? I, don't, I have no preference. I feel like Rachel would be... I feel like if Rachel gets out, um, she'll come... 
Taylor will come right to us. Yeah. Except, and I feel like if we got um, Taylor out, Rachel would go with JJ. It would be harder to get JJ out. That's why I want to get JJ out this round so that they didn't have anyone to go to. I think Connor has got to be the next to go. Like, he is a really powerful player in this game, and he knows what he's doing, and he has a huge chance to win immunity, and I just think we need to get rid of him. My biggest thing is I'm just, I just need to just try my hardest, work my butt out to get that immunity so I'm safe. Because um, I really don't want to go home. I really want to make it to the end. So, I, I mean, I came here to play and, you know, I want to make it to the end. I want to, I want to make it to the final two. And if, you know, I, I would hope to be the survivor. Welcome to your next immunity challenge, Jenny. Had a home here for a while with you. We'll see if it finds another home. Behind you is a sandy slope. At the top of that slope are a multitude of sticks. Most of them are blank, but several of them have a color painted under it. It's very predominant, so there's no questioning whether or not you have a painted stick or not. They are clearly painted. I will yell out a color and you all will race up the hill to find the colored stick that I asked for. The first five of you to grab one and come back, move on to the next round. Then we'll do it again. The top three who get the right stick move on to the next round. We'll do it with two people and then to get our winner. The first color you are looking for is orange. Connor moves on. Taylor moves on. Maggie moving on. Rachel moving on. One more spot. One more. And Jason moves on. All right, Jenny and Fred are out. You guys can go sit along that big rock over there. The next color you are looking for is Yellow! Rachel finds the yellow. And Maggie finds the yellow. Connor and Taylor take a seat on the rock. Good work. Two of you will move on to this next round. The color you are looking for is blue. coming in second place, <laughs> or if he'll win a challenge. Rachel and JJ, this is for immunity. The color you're looking for is brown. Well, I was really mad I didn't win because, I don't know, I kind of thought I would. It was really disappointing. 
And it feels really, really, really good to uh, win one again after lots of coming in second place. I was getting sick of second place, so like I said, I had needed to kick it into overdrive. I did. And so, yeah, it was nice. And Do you want to come over here and get the necklace? You're in the final six. Right. Hey, take a stand right by. Oops. Okay. Stay right here. Come here. Come here. All right. This also was for a bonus reward challenge. You and you can pick one other person. We'll go with me. Enjoy a couple slices of pepperoni oh, pizza man. and a cold beverage. You're picking one person. Who's going with oh, you? Gosh. Who wants it the most? I do. Show it up. Oh, geez, I don't know. Who are you going to pick, JJ? Uh, all right, Rachel, you, you were All right, Rachel and JJ going on reward. The rest of you can head back to camp. We'll see you at Tribal Council. I was going to go for um, JJ, but I think he realizes that he's the next to go. I think that's why why he had to win this. You knew, you knew that? I was pretty sure that JJ was going to pick Rachel. Like, it kind of bums me out just because I want to stay as close with Rachel and not him. And then also, kind of, I don't have Rachel here to strategize because I think we were going to pull a big move right now. But with her not here, I don't know if it's going to get planned and done well. I know what I want to do. I just want to mention Okay, I have no idea. That Me and Connor mm -hmm. usually have the same ideas. Curveball. Yeah, that kind of sucks. What do you think, Lynn? Uh, I don't, I think Jenny. I think this might be one of the only opportunities yeah. we can get her out. So I was thinking we should just get Jenny out. Okay. Alright. Well, that was okay. quick. Alright. Alright. Oh. Right. You thought I was going to disagree? Oh, I did. You did on the last few. The last one? The last one. No, if you wouldn't have disagreed on the last one, Rachel would have just won immunity. And you could be eating pizza right now. So how does that make you feel? I'm not that hungry. I'm so glad JJ picked me because I know I came in second, so he should have. I mean, it's just the right thing to do. But oh, we also have a really strong like alliance and kind of like, um, I don't know, we just have a strong bond. We've been through this from the beginning. We're together, kind of. So I kind of expected him to pick me. That tastes pretty good. I didn't realize how hungry I was until I saw that pizza, but it was so good. I'm really glad we got it. I was talking about going after on after the whole thing's over, but now I yeah. didn't have to. Now. And then that reward was really nice because I was actually talking about going to get pizza right after this is all done and I didn't even need to wait. Mm. Okay. It sucks yep. to get second. It does, I know. Yeah. I have my, my fair share. I think um, JJ winning immunity in this challenge. Um, I don't think it'll affect me extremely, like, a bunch, because he's not really part of, like, the powerhouse group. I mean, I still have to talk to, like, um, Jenny and other people, but, um, before the last tribal council, we were talking about getting Connor out, since he's such a, like, strong player, and we see him as kind of a threat, and I think now would be a good time. I just... Hope I will be able to trust Taylor and um, Rachel. Well, you know, um, this is gonna be an interesting one, I think. Uh, I know definitely friend Connor wanted to vote JJ out, but he got the immunity, which I'm actually kind of glad he did. I haven't said anything to them about not being allies because that would just be stupid. But we're hoping that, you know, I can try to play into that alliance that I already had and try to make it work to benefit me, Maggie, and JJ in the end. I'm not really sure what's gonna go down. It's kind of bad. But I don't know. What's, I hope it's not me, so I'm really nervous. Connor, he's a huge threat to us, and he's kind of a wild card. Like, we don't know what he's going to do because he seems kind of sneaky and, like, he has a plan kind of made up. So we just kind of think it's best to get rid of him. But we need to eliminate Jenny because she's been winning a lot of immunity challenges, and she just seems like a really big threat, too. She's, like, the same way as Connor. She's kind of sneaky. We don't know what she's up to. So we just need to get rid of her. Best friend. <laughs> I'm so fired up. I'm so pissed. <laughs> you know what I'm pissed about? Pretty much everything Taylor does. <laughs> Jeez, I don't even know why. Fred, I fixed your water Okay. Bottle. Oh, yeah. Thank you. 
Jeez. <laughs> I, I can't even reach this. Okay, you fixed it for nothing. You're the one who cut you know the what? string. I did not cut it. I was swinging it around and it no, broke. No, you cut the string I that did I not. stretched out for you. I, if you don't fix this, <laughs> I will sabotage you. I will you. fix it. Don't when? throw any fruit loops at me. Right Fred's a saboteur. Yeah. How long do you want it? I don't even know what that is. <laughs> I think I was, if I was to choose someone right now, I think it would be Jenny, just because she is a threat. We, she's shown that. She hasn't meant to, but she has shown that. <laughs> Fix it! <laughs> All right, and I want it so it can fit around my neck, and I can reach it when I need it. Do you not understand? All right, I need to survive out here. If I need my water, when I need my water, I cannot reach that far down. You know what, Rachel? You fix it. Rachel, I, don't, I can't even tie a knot. Okay. You want to cut it? Okay, uh, yes, I want you to cut it. Um, I think I'm just going to hang on to the hidden movie idol for now because I don't see myself at risk in like the near future. No! <laughs> Look at that! You're just being wasteful! You're being, we're in Survivor! We, oh, come on! Come on! Oh, that was close. Just stop. Go away. Fred! <laughs> wasted food, Fred! <laughs>
but, but you do think like you'll be here tomorrow. Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And if I caught her, you're the last one kind of iffy. Well, Why would you say I'll, that? I hope I'll be here tomorrow, but I'm just always afraid at every tribal council going into it. If you don't have that immunity, you're just always afraid. I am always afraid. So. All right, well, I'll tell you one thing. The one person who 100% is not going home is JJ. He has immunity. Everyone else, fair game. Connor. I don't even have anything to say. <laughs>